Hello everyone, I am the Flesh 3004. Welcome back to Valheim. Thank you for taking the time to hang out with me. I always enjoy hanging out with you. Welcome back to the channel. So, we uh, found ourselves a really nice place and we repaired it last time. We already have a bench and we have a chest and we have a bed. So now we have a better place to come to. It's not as small as our other one, that's for sure. Thinking we could probably back the bench up a little bit too. Maybe we should think about doing that. That might not be such a bad thing to do. Let's close the door so you don't get attacked. You never know. I want to see if we can leave some room in here. So let's let's do that, and then let's go ahead and see about. Oops. Here we go. Building the bench a little bit farther back than what it was okay maybe something about like that right there that should work okay all right let's go see cool let's go ahead and make sure everything's repaired all right now i don't know we can't upgrade anything yet because we don't have a lot of things to upgrade with. We need more bones. We need more of the the pig stuff to be able to do that. We don't have very much here, but we do have some at the other place. Okay, the storm is starting to ebb. If you go out in the storm, you get really, really wet, and that's not the best. And we should think about also upgrading this so what do we need we need 10 wood and 10 flint and make the chopping block again let's go see about that let's go to number two actually let's go to number six 10 wood and 10 f Ooh, hey i caught a fire i caught a fire owie, 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 owie. we are by the black forest as you can see right here looks like we have some animals to deal with we do need them anyway okay we also are going to be finding some other worse enemies around here too if we're not careful so we do got to be wary of that let's go first see i want to get some wood so let's go do that Okay, cool. Need 10 wood. And we also need some flint. Let's go see. I want to find flint. Also got to watch how much we have on our health, of course, as you know. So we need 10 flint. We should be able to get most of it right around here. Got lots of neck around us, that's for sure. We don't need to worry about that. It is extra food. It will help out a lot. That's cool. My friend and I were playing this weekend again, and we got quite far. We don't have exactly like a lot of big area or a big house or anything but we did make some pretty good progress and i'm excited to show you that when we get that far and something that i was thinking about doing too is you know we have this area out here and we have a bunch of bushes right out here that we can use so i'm gonna have to see about maybe getting like one of these or something repaired and maybe we can actually have an animal place that we can use course there is this chest here we can put stuff in here repair this place up both of them actually and see about making this our little farm place which would be good too because we do need to do that let's go out here this way um oh cool flip i want to get out to the island but I don't know exactly how we're going to do that safely. So one thing to know, if you see these reeds, that means that you can walk on the 
bottom and you don't have to worry about drowning or swimming or whatever. And that's always good, so do be aware of that. And of course you can't walk very fast in water, but I think most people are really aware that you cannot walk fast in water for real, so this game does take that into account. Kind of would be nice if we didn't always drop things whenever we swam, but or you know put them down or whatever, but we do. So that's just the way it is. Let's go see how much flint do we have. We have 11 flint. We have even more than enough wood. Hey, bud, how are you? So good of you to come visit again. We're back in the meadows. So this section is definitely in the meadows. Just want to make sure that we do have enough wood for all that we want to do right now. So together a little bit more. Okay. Let's go eat a raspberry. All right, let's go to three. Let's go to here. Let's do the butcher block. Let's put that right there. That should be good. Okay. And we'll lower that. Now, we got smoke inhalation. How do you like that? So you will get smoke if you're not careful when you're around stuff. Sometimes the smoke will get in you and it'll cause problems. So do be aware of that. All right, as you know, we have some tin around us, so we got to go and... What? Oh, that that is the upgraded hammer, is it? Oh, stone axe. We have the flint axe. We could probably take that guy down for right now. wonder what that was up there. Let's go looking around, and let's go see if we can find some of that tin that I was talking about. Hopefully we can find some tin. Ooh, look at that. There's a nice place out there, but we cannot get to that. I can tell you that much. You do have to be so very careful. Don't you come out here and find me like a man, huh? On you let's get up out of here come on come over here and do it there we go how do you like it huh all right, let's go to number seven, I guess it is. So we have our pick here that we made about two episodes ago, I guess. Let's just go ahead and start getting this stuff done. This is tin. As you can see, it says tin right there. We can mine a little bit, but it isn't exactly a lot, lot, so... Raw ore needs to be refined in the smelter before you can work it at the forge. To build a smelter, you would need certain core. Search for them in the dark places beneath the earth. It's probably going to be something not quite like that out there. Okay, I guess it was just Hugin going away. Thought I heard something bad. You gotta be so very careful. Let's go see if we can find some more tin. We should head back and sleep for the night again. Oh, goody! Skeleton! Skeletrons! Okay, let's go get out number four. And let's go ahead and drop number one. Oh, shoot! That's a one star! Yikes! Shoot, we died. Dog got it. Now we gotta go get our stuff back. Okay, let's go get our stuff back. Let's go put our stuff back on. Now we have another full inventory.
Oh, that's not good. That's not good. That's not good. Ooh, wee. Okay. Oh, boy, that was close. Let's go ahead and eat another one of these. Oh, so I heard them talking about circling cores. As soon as I can find a place that we need, I can show you those. Well, we got to get to that place first. Oh, that's a bird. It's a plane. It's a bird plane. Let's get back over to our base right now. Let's sleep for the night since it is. Okay, good. New items, puke berries. Those are interesting things. So if you eat them, um, you do exactly what they say. You vomit. It's truly lovely. What do we need for a chest? That would be miscellaneous. Building, I guess it is. Furniture? I don't know where it is. Looks like we have enough. Okay, let's go build ourselves another chest. And then we'll sleep for the night. Can't see anything. Three. Chest. Let's put that guy. Right here. Like this. Alright. There we go. So now we have this chest. And let's just go ahead and drop in a few things. I really don't want to be messing around with those guys, so let's just... Doggone it! What are you... Alright, let's go take care of business. Oh boy, that guy's bad. Run away, run away, run away. Yikes. That almost hurt. Oh boy, we gotta be really, really careful. Tie gun brutes. Oh, we need some stamina, please. Yeah, we're gonna bite it again if we're not careful. Too bad the bow takes so much stamina, you know? Oh, man. That was tough. All right. That's the problem. Nighttime is so dangerous. Oh man, we knocked him a long ways away. How do you like that? Alright, let's sleep right now while we still can. Hokey jamokies. <sighs> See you in the morning. Good morning. Oh, boy, that was rough last night, man. 
so we need to make sure that we do have enough to eat and everything um what do we have in this one let's just go ahead and drop whatever we don't need to be carrying with this all the time stone axe flint axe let's go ahead and just put the stone axe in here for one thing if we die we at least can get something we'll put the tin in there and we'll go and drop a bunch of this stuff that we really don't need to be carrying right at this moment all right that helps our weight quite a bit and let's just go ahead and put that in there too that's gonna help out a lot let's go repair everything wow that was a lot okay what we need to do is go around and find some more tin and if I remember right there was some tin fairly close by here tin deposits sweet and then we also have some other stuff that we have to get to, so we're going to have to see about that. Okay. So let's gather up quite a bit of tin. It does weigh a lot, just so you know. It weighs quite a lot. As you can see, we're already up to 127, and we have only gained a few pieces. That's one of the worst things about the tin. But we're going to need it, so let's gather it. I'm trying to make sure that I do listen all the time, because we need to listen, because there could be very, very bad things around here. Looks like there's another tin node right there. Okay. Couple of them. How do you like that? Let's go and get ourselves another bite to eat. It'll help with our stamina and keep our health up at the same time. How much are you weighing? Okay, 191. This is probably going to take well over 200, like 220. Okay, we're at 225. Let's go back, drop this into our chest. And then we'll head back out and see if we can find some more. That would be great if we could, huh? All right, we are over. Oh, hey, look, there's another skeleton over there. We are at a crossing place here. And there's an orange glow, a, orange glow, a green glow up here. We are still in the... Forest. Let's go see... If we could take out a skeleton. Sweet. Okay, we did. Skeleton. Come here, Skeletron. And the, the club is the best thing for the Skeletron. Run away, run away. Club just does the best. Need to make a shield, don't I? I keep forgetting. Okay. We know we have four bones, and that's okay. Alright, he's gone. We got that. Right here, this is a thistle. So let's go ahead and get those. And here's Hugi. Whoa! Ah, nice. Del Delves and dungeons can be found across the tenth world. They are monuments of the past and most often filled with the riches of civilizations long lost. Remember to bring a light source. All right, let's go to M and let's mark this place right here. This should be a crypt. Cool, so now we have a crypt. Thank you, Hugie. Let's go ahead and gather up some more of these. While I'm looking around, let's go see if we can find anything else that I was also looking for. Some t 
ten right there. Okay. So we can't go out there too far. We, we, we can go out there. It's just, you know, not going to be the best forest, forest for us. Let's go back. Let's drop the tin. We will come back here and we will go into the crypt. I will see you back at the crypt here in a quick second. All right, before we go into that crypt area i'm thinking what we should probably do is make something that's gonna come in really handy we need four of the leather scraps and we can make a wood shield i think we should probably do that that would be for the best so let's go ahead and make a wood shield let's craft that okay cool now we have that I don't know if we can upgrade the wood shield. We're going to need two more of that. But for right now, I think that should actually help us out quite a bit. And then we click on it. Now it's equipped. Now the only time it isn't going to be equipped is when we are using our bow. As can be expected. Let's... The heck, there's Hugi. Thought I heard him. Hi, Yugi. You have crafted a shield. A shield allows you to block incoming damage. If your timing is perfect, the enemy may also be parried. Be careful, though. If you block too many hits, you will become staggered. The amount of damage you can block before becoming staggered depends on your maximum health. So if you plan on tanking a lot of tanking a lot of damage you should eat food that increases your health heavier shields will block more damage but will also slow you down okay all right let's go to m let's ping the crypt it is right over there that way let's go see what we can find our torch is not doing too bad, so I'm not exactly too worried about it for right now. And the crypt should be getting really close by. Make sure we have out our trusty axe. I did get quite a bit more tin on the way back. I know we have over 30 tin. We have like probably closer to 60, I think. All right, let's... Straight ahead, pretty much. So let's make our way over to there. And go see if we can get inside there. That would be good. It's going to be dangerous in there. Um, so right now, what we need to do is also... Okay, we need five stone. I meant to grab that, and I totally forgot. While looking for stone, I ran across something else that's really good. Blueberries! Yay! So now we have even more food that we can use. Sweet. That's going to help out a lot. That's going to keep up our stamina really good. And that's going to be for the best. And there's a lot of it around here. I've only got that one stone, but I just thought I would show you the blueberries. And hopefully that will be good enough. There we go. Two more stones. They're so hard to see sometimes. It's crazy how hard it is they are to see at times. Okay, let's go back in there now. We'll make a campfire once we get inside there. Three. Cool, we can make it. How soon? Now, where is it? Right there. All right. Well, let's go and get out our torch and let's go in here. So these are burial chambers, as you can tell. Let's go to here. Let's get this out and let's go to number four. Apparently we can't do the... Uh, the heck apparently we can't there we go 
Let's try to figure out what the heck we're doing. Let's make a campfire right here for right now. That's going to help us out the most. Okay. All right, there we go. Now we have that. So now we can also block. It's going to be dark in here, and I do apologize for that, but that's the way that these places are. There are lots of rooms in here. We may die, just so you know. So let's just start right back here. There are doors we have to go through. Um, let's go to number four. And it is going to be dark. I do apologize. Okay. Nothing in this room, as you can see. Let's go to number four. Let's open this door. Another door there. And nothing here. Okay. There's going to be a skeleton on the other side of this. I can just about guarantee it because I can hear something. Let's shut that door and let's open up this door. Cool. Got here. Now these are really good. Okay. I do see what we are looking for. These things right here, these are certainly in cores. Let's go ahead and make sure that we keep this up. And let's go ahead and eat that. Sweet. Okay, there we go. And these things do weigh quite a bit, so we do got to be careful of that. Let's go out here. We'll leave these doors open as we go. One area done. We did that. Every time my friend and I come in these, we always die due to, you know, bad guys. Okay, sorry about the darkness. Door there and a door there. Let's open this up. Skeleton. Cool, got that. And the nice thing is, these yellow mushrooms always respawn in here, so this is always a good place to get them at. I really don't like that. That sounds scary. Get that. Another circling core and another mushroom. Okay. Believe all of this area is now done. Now we also got to go into here. Okay. Doesn't look like there's anything in here, so that's good. All right, this area is done, which means that we have the worst and probably last area. Let's come up here and let's sit up here for a quick minute. And let's just go ahead and make sure that we keep ourselves good. Oops, smoked. There we go. All right gonna wait here for just a quick minute and then we will head out okay our resting is done now let's head over here we do have the campfire and that's good all right in we go our torch is getting low Okay, good. One guy done. Alright. Nothing back here. There is a torch there, but that doesn't do us any good. Okay. Let's open up this door. 
Oh, those are ghosts. Those are ghosts. Oh shoot, that's a one star uh, skeleton. All right, we'll come back in. Okay, and just now, just barely inside. Let's get our stuff. Put our stuff on. Let's replace that. Eight and four. Okay, so as I said, there are these wafting things. Woo! One star skeleton. That's, oops, it's lovely. Let's get our health up. Before we open that door again. Okay. Oh boy, we're probably gonna bite it again, but we will see. Oh man, we need to probably get off this guy. Oh, this is tough. This is tough. Can't eat any more right now. We're just gonna have to wait for a tiny little bit. There goes our health up a little bit. Okay. All right, we got that done. Gotta wait for a quick minute. Oh, uh, this is tough. Oh, shoot! Oh, man, he broke down the door. How do you like that? That's not good. All right. Sorry it's so dark, it's just kind of the way it has to be right now. Our weight is 89. Okay. Alright, there goes our health a little bit. Oh, so tough, so tough, so tough. Okay, there goes our health some more. Evil bone pile, huh? All right, there we go. Cool, we got that done. Oh boy, what is this back here? Huh, okay. Said our torch is almost out, so we do gotta be very careful. Let's do that and that. All right, let's go back to number two. Again, I apologize for the darkness. Uh, that's the way out, I think. Okay. Oh, nice. Another mushroom, sweet. And these ones are really good. They are quite good, that's why I collect them. Okay, there's that, we've been in here, but we have not been through here. Sweet. Oh, run away! These guys are very, 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 very bad. Oh, 
Oh, shoot. Almost had him, too. All right. We'll be back. All right. Let's go see if we can finish this. It is going to be super dark. Get out of here for a quick minute. Let's get everything done. Woo. All right. Do you and do you. Then we go right back in and let's finish this off. Don't know what he is attacking, but he sure is attacking. Got him! Yes. Oh man, I hope we don't have any more of those guys because they are danger us. Cool. Ooh, Amber. Okay, we do gotta be careful how much weight we, we, we got. So this is where you find Amber. There's a chest here. We're just gonna go ahead and take all. Okay, 103. We're still doing good. All right. Let's go get these. Okay. One of the nice things is with these crypts, what my friend was saying is, once you clear them, they are cleared. You don't ever have to worry about them ever again. The mushrooms will, will respawn, but the creatures in them will not. And you may hear sounds and stuff, but there are no other creatures or anything in here to worry about. And that is one of the best things. All right, we did it. We got this crypt cleared. Let's put on our clothes. We actually did that without that. Can you believe that? We took them out like that. That's crazy. Good, we did it. We also got a bunch of certain cords. We got eight. Let's go to um, three. Now let's go see, I think, crafting. Okay, we only need five certain cores, but we need the workbench and 20 stones, so that's not a big deal. And so we actually need 10 certain cores all told. So we're gonna have to find another place to get some more of these at. But at least you gotta see some of that, so that's always good too. Okay, let's get out of here. And let's head back home. It is nighttime. We're gonna have to basically try to run home as fast as we can. So I am gonna do that. And we're just gonna get the heck out of here while we can. Oh man. Good thing is we can get our torch now because we're so close to home. Can always build another one. Torches cannot be repaired, just so you know. Our health is at 100. That's good. We do got guys following us. Okay. There he is. Come here. Come here, Dweezil Brain. Okay. All right, sweet. Let's go ahead and get ready to sleep for the night and then we'll go over everything that we got and see about doing some more stuff here. We'll see you in the morn. Wait, what? Okay, there we go. 
Couldn't figure out what the heck was going on. Good morning. Apparently, I don't think anything bad happened. Let's go repair all of our stuff. There's going to be a lot of stuff to repair. Okay, that's good. And now, let's go ahead and see if we can get some more stuff put away. We do have some good blueberries, and that is awesome. That will help us out the most. Let's go ahead and see about putting some of this other stuff away. Let's put the amber away. I did take the other axe that was in there, so we do have that. And now we also have the serpent cores. We also have a skeleton trophy, and we should have a whopping lot of bones now. What that means is, I thought we had bones somewhere. Apparently, we've just been carrying them on us. We can upgrade a lot of things, but we're going to have to do that next time. I think we have some at our other base. Okay, cool. We'll just worry about that later. So I just really wanted to try to get some of this stuff done so that way we don't have to worry about it all right well this is grounded uh, grounded this is valheim thank you for joining me here i hope you had a good time i had a wonderful time we now have a crypt cleared we can go back in there get those yellow mushrooms anytime that we want to and we do have quite a few of those we also need to work on getting some animal pens set up, and we will do that soon. I just wanted to try to get that other stuff done. We do have a lot of tin, but now we need to look for another resource that's going to be out there somewhere. And I don't know exactly where, but we got to go and look for that. If you like what you see here, consider subscribing. If you like the video, drop a like on the video, leave comments, and I will talk to you next time you have a great day bye bye